It's an urban legend that's known throughout Mexico and also the United States. The woman that danced with the devil. What the f like many other urban legends, there's different takes on the story, like depending on the region. So the first one I'm gonna talk about took place in Tijuana. And it was about a, a girl who was rebellious. She liked to sneak out a lot to local discos and clubs and stuff like that. There was this one time where she was partying two days in a row, like straight. I guess on that night, she was already feeling tired. She just wanted to go home and rest. But then her friends convinced her to go to another nightclub the following night. She was like, you know what? Okay, whatever, I'll go. And then the next day comes, her mom's telling her not to go because it's basically Holy Week that week and she wants them to go to, to church. She doesn't listen. She ends up sneaking out and she goes to a nightclub called the Aloha nightclub. As the night was going, she kind of felt bad for sneaking out. And then she told herself, All right, I'm gonna just take one more shot and then I'm out of here. And then that's when the guy comes, I guess, swoops her off her feet type shit. They go dance and they're dancing for a long ass time to the point where she doesn't remember how much they how much they dance for, like how many songs passed already. They're just dancing the night away. All eyes are on them dancing. The girl notices. She's like looking around and stuff, like, why are they looking at us like that? She ends up looking down. The guy had hooves her feet and then looks at the guy's face it's all distorted and devilish looking and stuff she ends up passing out the only thing she remembers is waking up to the paramedics and like the place is on fire witnesses say that after she fainted the devil was laughing and ran to like one of the back rooms and like later disappeared and place went on fire and now the second story this one takes place in stockton california a club called the flamingo club